swap a lease is another thing uh, if you don't have like an auto loan on your credit um, you have to get an auto loan you have to get a, like some kind of big payment primary account like an auto loan or or a, a mortgage but we don't want to we don't want you to get stuck in that 30 year mortgage if you're not you know if you don't if you can't don't know for sure if you can afford it because 30 years is a very long time so many things happen in 30 years you know um, we wouldn't want you to get something like that and then default on it just trying to build your credit so you can go to swap a lease I did a video about this swap a lease in Turo and also hire a car you can go on swap a lease find a vehicle that somebody has a lease on and they'll be looking to swap that lease to you for a certain amount of time so let's say six months twelve months whatever it is you can get a Lamborghini off of swap a lease um, and you pay you'd be paying like thirty six hundred dollars a month for it but if you put it on Turo it rents out at thirteen hundred dollars a day so you rent it out for three days uh, out of the month and you your whole car note is paid for so you can drive a Lamborghini the rest of the month just using that uh, just using that strategy and also you're building positive payment history there's a few different things you can do with it you can actually get a, a, a smart car you can get a smart car for that's like one is like a hundred like uh, between a hundred and like a hundred seventy dollars a month something like that but what you do with it is you go to other businesses and say look uh, and you think about it as well if you're a business owner and I walk into, into your building and say look I have a vehicle uh, I want to put your logo on it it's gonna cost you 170 a month but I'll put your logo on the side of my vehicle and it's, it's, it's always going to be driving around in the city so people will constantly see your logo or your contact information to get you more clients. Um, and you don't have to drive a smart car. You know, like I know, the smart car is not that pretty. You know, if a mosquito, if you're driving and a mosquito hit that thing, the airbag is going to come out because they're so small. You know, but you, somebody that's driving Uber Eats, somebody that's driving Grubhub, you know, Uber, no, not Uber. Group, uh, Uber Eats, Grubhub, you know, things like that, they'll be more than happy to drive those vehicles and do like deliverers and things like that because they're making income as well. So you're charging 170 to put the logo on it, which is your whole car note, your whole payment already. And then you're charging your driver 170 a week. And four weeks out of the month is, uh, I think it's like 560 or something like that. It's a nice bit of money. Uh, so you make an income from that. Plus, you got three different sides on the vehicle. You don't have just one logo now, you got one on the front. I mean, one on the side, uh, driver door, passenger door, and the back of the vehicle. You got three logos on there, each one of them paying $170 a month. You just made three times your payment with just the logos. That's not even including the person driving the vehicle around. Uh, so there's a whole bunch of different ways you can do that. And also, it's building your personal credit while you're doing it. So swap a lease is another thing. So add a positive account to your credit. Um, and once that lease is over you give that vehicle back to that person so you just pretty much lo uh, they're loaning it to you and you're making the payments on it you know how if you meet somebody with a nice car you say look man let me let me have that car or let me borrow your car they say yeah you can have it if you take over if you pay the note that's pretty much what it is they let you pay the note for a certain amount of time and then you give the car back to them 